So we are at the entrance of Jericho right now. Right over there is the Mount of Temptation. So today we're going to be visiting the Mount of Temptation and the Monastery of the Temptation. Hopefully if they open. And also the lowest cable car in the world. It's 9 o'clock in the morning and we are very hungry. So let's go see if we can have breakfast here in Jericho. The best hummus and breakfast place is always at the back street. Hidden place. Yeah, hidden gym. The best hummus now because it's all done by hand. That's why it's not so soft, but the taste is amazing. This is a breakfast where you know mostly everybody in the country have mostly hummus, full falafel, and of course some vegetables. You know what? Did you see here spoons or forks or knives? No, because this is the way. This is for this is everything. We eat like this. Shut down. Wow. Is it good? Mm. Oh. Enjoy. So as you see guys, the people of Palestine are very generous. So the guy, the owner, he brought us another plate on the house. Which is a different kind of thing. It's fatta. It is bread mixed with hummus and hummus uh, water that is boiled. And it's amazing with garlic and lemon. Let me taste. Whoa! Out of this world. Cherigo is down there. Tel Sultan? Tel Sultan, yes. Tel Sultan, okay. 10,000 BC. pools. The water comes all the way from Jerusalem by aqueducts from the rainwater since 2000 years from the Roman period until today. And here is the Mount of Temptation. 
where Jesus fasted for 40 days after he was baptized by John at the Jordan River, very close from here. He came into the wilderness driven by the Holy Spirit and he spent 40 days of fasting and he was tempted by the devil. So now we are going up to the cable car station and from there we're gonna walk up to the monastery. Yeah, I hope we, we reach until there. Are you ready, Tyler, in this heat to walk? Ta da! Little bit more, little bit more. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah, we made it! We made it a lot. I said to Fadi, let's go drink coffee before we start to go up there. So we should drink coffee. Actually, we are at the visitor center of the cable car and they have restaurants, they have nice views and also some souvenir shops. Even come here just, you know, for lunch, for dinner, ah, for a I nice view, for an It's very nice. Evening you know, time, beautiful. To see all the lights from the city down. Wow, look at you. And just beyond the city, right over there, you know, in the haze, that's where the Jordan River is. And going all the way to the Dead Sea, which is just to the south. But it's very hazy today. This is a very nice place. Oh no, bad luck. Looks like the monastery is closed, even if it should be open. Let's wait for a while. It is closed. But I want at least to show you, you know, the Laura, you know, the caves where monks used to dwell, what we call Laura. Since the second century AD, monks came from all over the world to dwell in these caves and to follow the steps of Christ. So you can see all these caves used to be dwellings for monks. And the monastery is right on the top. It is built, but the problem, it is closed. But the monastery is built on a cave, exactly like the one we see in front of us in the mountain. It's a very sheer drop, as you see. But here we can still see also some dwellings from the monastery. If you look, it is just built right on the cliff of the mountain. See these dwellings? also part of the monastery itself. And this is the place where believed according to tradition that Jesus was tempted by the devil while he was fasting.